In this screencast, I'm going to teach you how to create a mashup video using Creative Commons licensed video clips and YouTube video editor. The first thing that you need to do is log into YouTube with your school Gmail address. If you haven't already done so, you may be asked to create a channel. Once you're logged into YouTube, click on your Gmail address, then click on Video Manager, and then click on Creation Tools and Video Editor. Once you're in the video editor, you'll have a variety of different options. Under this camera, you'll see all of your videos if you've uploaded anything to YouTube. These are available for you to add into your presentation. If you click on the Creative Commons icon, you'll see that there's a search bar and you can search by, in, by topic to find clips with Creative Commons attribution licenses. If you click on the photo, the photo icon, you'll see that you can add your own images for example, you could upload a Google drawing that has photo credits on it. If you click the music note, you'll see that you have access to a variety of audio tracks. There are a variety of transitions that you can add, as well as text. I like to start by creating a title, so I'm going to drag that title down to the timeline. You can change your background color. You can change the color of your text, the size of your text, and the font of your text. If you go back down here and click on the camera again, then you click on the photo icon, you can add a picture, just drag and drop it. Click on the camera again. This time I'm going to add a Creative Commons video clip. It's called Me Making Stovetop Popcorn. I did not create it, but it's going to work really well. I'm going to drag it down. I'm going to click on audio and turn the volume off because I'm going to be adding a song later. And I'm also going to click on the scissors, drag it, and then left mouse click to cut it, and then I'm going to get rid of that clip. So I'm going to also get part of the end off. right about there and then I'm going to divide this clip into three pieces so click on the scissors scroll left mouse click I'm going to do the same thing over here click on the scissors left mouse click so I have three little video clips right now if you want to add text to those video clips you just click on the A I'm going to pick a banner, I'm going to drag it on top of my canvas, and then start adding text. You can change the color of your banner, you can change its height and its opacity. You can also filter the image. Some more text. Oh, you need to make sure that you click enable text if you actually want to see that text pop up, and you can filter it. Okay. text. I'm adding another filter. Okay, this time, so I'm going to click on the camera again. This time I'm going to add some transitions. So I'm going to add some transitions in between these clips. So I'm going to do a transition here. Okay. I'm going to 
to click on the camera again. This one I need to put a filter on. Right, I like that. Right. And then I'm going to add another video clip. This one's called Ants Like Popcorn. I'm going to drag the whole thing down. Click on audio to get rid of the audio. Click on the scissors to split it. Left mouse click. I'm going to add a transition. I'm going to add a filter. And I'm going to add some text. Make sure you hit enable text, which I forgot to do. Alright, I'm going to click on this camera again, I'm going to get my end credits by clicking on my camera, Dra drag it down, and then I'm just going to add some song, add, add a song, so I'm going to click on the camera, go back up to the music note, and the song that I found that I like is called Hot Buttered Popcorn. And I'm going to drag it into this box where it says drag audio here. And let's see how that goes. Click on the camera. You can make your clips shorter, you can add more text, but you get the idea. Once you've previewed it, if you like it, you can hit publish and that will publish your video for you. Just remember to add your video credits to the end. Um, it's a good idea to scope those things out before you put this together so that it's, it's easy to do. Anyway, good luck.